This is the Defense News Minute for December 10th, 2019. I'm Jeff Martin. The House and Senate have released a sweeping defense policy bill that creates a new Space Force, authorizes funds for the military, and drops contentious border wall restrictions. The almost 3,500-page bill supports $738 billion in defense spending, and a vote in both chambers is expected this week. Now, as for that new Space Force, it's going to have a Chief of Space Operations on the Joint Chiefs of Staff and will be housed into the Air Force. In addition, numerous fighters, ships, and vehicles have all been authorized to help modernize all of the military branches. And the Navy's new top priority is to fix the troubled USS Gerald Ford, as the new Acting Service Secretary, Thomas Modley, says the service needs to fix it so that its problems can't be used against the Navy. Up next in that process is both fixing the weapons elevators and certifying the Ford's flight deck, a process that is set to begin in March. That will be followed by full ship shock trials, and the ship will then enter the pre-deployment workup in late 2022 and deploy in mid-2023. To get more coverage, visit DefenseNews.com, and thanks for watching this Defense News Minute.